Hi there, this is Laura Brandenburg with Bridging the Gap and we help business analysts start their careers. I wanted to come and talk about a, a really big challenge that's popping up in the community and it's been a challenge for a long, long time. And that's what do you do to avoid missing requirements? So we see a lot of new BAs kind of just really scared that once they get started in the profession that they're gonna miss something big and you know bad things are gonna happen in their career if they do that. We also see a lot more experienced BAs. Uh, one comment we just received recently was somebody who's like, I've been doing this for 15 years. I don't really feel like I have the complete skill set, and something always feels a little bit off. And what that offness probably means is like you feel like you're missing something, right? Like you don't have that confidence that you have a clear and complete view of the requirements. And we know that a requirement, um, that missing requirement that gets discovered after the software is implemented or the change has been made, it costs way, way more to fix that kind of problem than if you discover it in the requirements process in the first place. And in my experience, missing requirements come down to just two really main root causes. There's two things or lack of things that we do that causes us to miss requirements as business analysts. And the first one of those is that we only look at one perspective of the requirements. So people from more of a business view tend to look at the business process and what the users have to do. People from more of a technical view tend to look at the technical requirements and kind of not so much that business view. And really you need to look at three different perspectives, all different views of the requirements to make sure that your picture of what's getting built is clear and complete. Uh, and that's something that we can help you do. We have a free training series right now available about the business analyst blueprint that covers these three perspectives. You can get it at bridging the gap slash free or click below to register. So the other um, key challenge that we see though that it that really causes BAs to miss requirements is that their stakeholders aren't involved completely or um, the communication between the business analyst and either the business stakeholders or the technical stakeholders or both isn't as comprehensive as it needs to be. So it's not a lot enough to just look at requirements from all the different perspectives. You also need to be engaging the right stakeholders in all those different perspectives to ensure that their information is coming through into the requirements, that they're involved in the discovery, the analysis, and the validation process. And that's why as we go through each of those three skill sets in that free blueprint training, we don't talk just about the hard skills or the analysis models that you need. We also talk about the community communication skills and how do you actually interact with stakeholders to make sure that the information that goes into the, those models is clear and complete again. And that's really how you avoid missing requirements. So I have a lot more to teach you. There's this three part video training series. It's completely free, but it's only going to be available for a limited time. So please click below, check out the free training. Um, Tell us what you think about it. Leave me a comment. Share this with someone you know if you think that they could benefit from it as well. So the link is below or you can just go to bridgingthegap.com and it does have hyphens in it slash free, F-R-E-E, -E, super simple. So look forward to providing this training for you and hearing what you think. I'll talk to you soon. Again, Laura Brandenburg from Bridging the Gap.